Hello, fix -a Tony here. Uh, today I am going to be repairing my cross bars on my uh, 2018 Chrysler Pacifica. Uh, so the issue that I was having is uh, I had used the cross bars to carry my cargo box and I had tried to remove, because these are thumb screws, right? That's kind of how it works. And then these store in the roof rails. And then when you're wanting to use them, they bend down, right? And you can kind of uh, mount them onto a new hole. So this is all thumb screw based. And what happened was, um, let me zoom in. What happened was the thumb screw stripped out. So I just kept rotating. Um, and, and I was unable to actually remove the, the, um, the rail. Um, or the, yeah, the crossbar you know, from its mounting hole after I was finished with it, so it was stripped. Um, actually, both ends are stripped, um, but I'm gonna just show you uh, how to do a quick uh, repair. So what you have to do, unfortunately, is um, if it's stripped and it's still inside, this is the new one, um, but if it's stripped and it's turning, you're gonna have to get a pair of pliers and you're basically gonna be pulling this off um, and peeling it off so that um, this sort of flat head is exposed and then you're gonna to have to get a pair of needle nose pliers or a pair of lineman pliers and and just basically turning it off um, uh, loosening it uh, to get it to get it off um, so now now that this is off uh, what you got to do is you have to pull off this little plastic retaining clip so I got a pair of pliers and then it pulls off and this is sort of what it looks like, okay? So the new one, maybe they did something different with it. Maybe they didn't, uh, who knows? Um, but then the way this goes back in is you're going to put just this through and then you're gonna sort of hold it and flip it over. And then you need to get this plastic retaining clip Remember this big side, the smooth side, uh, faces the mounting surface, and then this uh, male portion. What you gotta do is you have to just insert it over top until you hear a click, one click. Uh, let's see. Ah, oh, just broke a nail. All right. And you want it loose there and then you need to be able to turn this right so it's nice and loose and it's ready to go so basically um, just got to do this exact same thing uh, to the other side and then it should be should be good to go and it matches the old the oil this is actually this has also been replaced um, I actually had it replaced by the dealer under warranty but now the warranty is off um, so I had to buy my new uh, thumb screws. So I guess the original factory ones didn't last very long. So be mindful of that. Um, the other thing I wanted to let you guys know is what the part number is. So interestingly, it's quite difficult uh, to use the part finder um, uh, on, on Mopar.com. So it's a little bit trickier than I thought. A lot of paging through and thumbnailing. I think... In all of the new Pacificas, 2018 to 2020, I would imagine, um, this part number is going to be the same. Um, and uh, the part number, this is kind of what it is here. So I'm going to hold that. You can pause it and write it down. Um, and you should be good to go. Um, so thank you very much for watching. Nice, quick, short repair. And I'll be able to get this back on my van um, as we're heading out on holiday. Thank you very much.